Hey everybody, thanks for watching. And tonight's video is going to feature Chad McCoy and Brad Heil and their black and tans. It was a pretty good time and I thank those guys for taking me. And I thank you guys for watching these videos and making this possible. And keep in mind, with Christmas coming up, you can use my discount code with Dogtra and that's Stark5. And you can also use my discount code Stark10 when you're buying a big dog light. So that should help you guys out this Christmas season. Save a little money and get someone a nice gift. Or a Patreon subscription is a nice gift too, where you can get early access to all my videos and exclusive content and behind the scenes and live action as I'm actually in the woods making these videos. Also before this hunt, I got together with these guys and we sat down and recorded a podcast. So make sure you check out my podcast, which is called the Stark Outdoors Podcast. And it's available on all podcasting platforms. It was a great conversation. I hope you guys really enjoy it. I had a great time with these guys. I look forward to hunting with them again coon, deer, and a little bit of everything. So that should be it for the announcements, and I hope you guys enjoy this video, and thanks for watching. You just never know if one loses the signal. Yeah. Who don't know? <laughs> Cardi and what other one you got? Poncho. Poncho. There's a cabin right there. Oh, Cardi right here. Turn and Cardi loose first. Yeah, let's see what happens. Right. Walk her up that lane just a little bit. Point her towards there. Usually throw a big locate yeah, for trees. She's, she's actually got a really good locate. And if she does it, you you should definitely know. Up through there, I was treeing them all right through here. And she's there. <laughs> Gonna blow it. Pretty deep. Yeah. This depend we need we need him to go about three hundred more yards, then we can drive. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're gonna have to walk. We're hoofing it. Yep, because it's gonna be the same amount of distance probably to drive around. Well, this might be easier for us to get in this field. I 
Yeah, it does. Well, well I'm going to do the next one. Taking Cardi B again. Rain's loud. Where's she at? In the bend? Uh, yeah, you know where it makes that L, she's straight. Okay. And now she's working it back towards that L. Now she's bringing it back up towards this edge, kind of zigging. again. Yep. Hopefully he don't run around the edge. <laughs> he goes in the woods or something. Is that it? I've had him go all the way down to the end of that, to that road down there. One thing I'm going to start asking people I'm hunting with, have you noticed a big difference since you hunted with me that first time as far as people contacting you about dogs? Oh yeah, I've had a lot, a lot of phone calls. Uh, People, I've actually poncho bred about 12 females this summer, and I don't know if the video had a lot to do with it, but people could actually see him in action that you know has never been hunting with him, and they like his hunt style and stuff. But I've had a lot of people call and want pups. Um, definitely noticed a big difference of people calling. Almost sounds like he was about to just fall tree. Mm -hmm. He did. He covered a lot of territory. See where he's at. Okay. Yeah, he went through. It's like he went through, the, went down there, went through the woods over here, combed it all back, and went back to that far corner. But he just threw a couple locates, but I ain't heard him since. There's some big old trees in this woods. I mean, they're the size of the ranger hood. <laughs> No probably tree to lay up on one of them. It'd be, I mean, some of those trees are huge. I mean, you couldn't even hardly shine them all, yeah. even when the leaves are off. There's quite a few like that around home where if you tree on them, there's usually one tucked in somewhere. You can barely see it. Mm -hmm. There we go. Sounds pretty good from here. Yeah. About 600. Well, we'll drive to that as far as we can. <laughs> yeah. Good job, bud. decided to head back get a couple different dogs that way you guys can see some more dogs in action what kennel you got open oh seven what dogs are we going to take out now we're going to grab lefty and uh, his mom sadie
Sadie. Come on, lad. Matthew, come on. <coughs> so he needs one more win to be titled? Yeah, he needs one more win to be night champion. I think I've had him in about mm, 10 hunts, and I think he's won seven of them. That's what, that's what I like right there, and they leave like a rocket. How old is he? He's two. He just turned two. Yeah, he hooked it through the field. He's heading to the left. Oh, he went to the left already? Yeah. I figured he would have went straight. Mm -mm. In the last video, we, we talked about Poncho a lot. You uh -huh. want to tell me kind of what Cardi B's won? Um... Cardi B, she's off a of rapper and Sadie, which is a half sister to uh, to Lefty here. And Cardi's, well, she's a Grand Knight. She won. She's won at Autumn Oaks. I'm trying to think. There's Lefty. Um, she's got second in the Breed Days, the PKC Breed Days. I'm trying to think, what else does she win? Oh, Walker Days, I placed. I think fifth or sixth. I can't remember. Remember anything? No, I can't remember nothing on top of my head. She's won some mini slams, I think, at the Winter Classic. Yeah, she won two mini slams at Autumn Oaks. Autumn Oaks, yeah. She just turned three. Cardi did. We plan on bringing her to, to Poncho. That Here. should be a nice cross. Yeah. You know how he. He struck here, but he's already 500 yards this way. <laughs> yeah, like, that's the thing. He just, he'll hit here and there, and it's just like, he, it's like he'll skip a track. If he if he's not going to treat it real quick, he's looking to ambush one. Yeah. Yeah. That's his somewhat of a locate. And, I mean, it hasn't even been... It ain't been three minutes. Three or four minutes since He's we turned loose. Seven eleven. Yeah. Right on the river. He sounds good too. Oh yeah, I mean he's got a nice clear mouth. If anything, if he had just a little better locate, you know, that's the only thing I would. So, we'll get to driving. We'll probably have to walk a couple hundred yards. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, buddy. Now I'm at the bank of the river. He's up into here into these trees. Good boy. Job there. Can you tell you get a can in three minutes? That's 700 yards of play. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't just one either, it was two. <laughs> yeah, we'll let the other one get in. Yeah. Said she's nine. I'm getting ready. Right. Getting ready to nine. Right, this is Sadie. Mm -hmm. She's big for a female. Yeah, good looking. You got Buddy and Mandy too. See that's in the black and tan breed. You don't see too many of them that you can cut across the field, and they'll go hunting. Yeah, they were right, right from the tailgate. I mean, how much ground do you think she's covered total? Oh, she's probably already uh -huh. went a mile. 
just according to the Can ground. Can you see it on there? <laughs> He's over there, I mean, in that back field. Yeah, she got in here pretty deep. Cut the distance. Oh, oh, oh. After Sadie made that last den tree there, we decided it was getting pretty late, but we're gonna make one last cut with the dogs. And Lefty did such a good job before, we decided to put him on the stopwatch and show you guys something pretty special. He's a really nice young dog, and he gets treed quick. I'm gonna set the timer for this one. Alright, really? The dragster. One minute, what is he? 600. 700. Right at two and a half minutes now. I'll back out. Good job, buddy. Get Thank you guys for watching this video and if you've watched all the way to the end I really appreciate it and if you're new here make sure you hit the subscribe button and like the video if you enjoyed it also I have a really big Christmas special coming up that will air on Christmas and it's going to be something really special with a lot of really well known people and a lot of really good dogs and I really know you guys will like that one and I'm really looking forward to sharing it with you guys and thank you for watching.